Hi, Mama Mama Razzle Dazzle here. I just want to tell you today about some really great things I brought from Knit Picks. This particular I set of items comes as a kit and it's called the I Love Llamas Kit. So you can go to knitpicks.com to get that and I'll have a link for you below. First item that I love to pieces is this lovely mug. It's a 14 ounce mug and it's got a bunch of llamas all around it. So from any side that you're drinking you will see one of these happy little llamas. It's 14 ounces so that's a pretty good size. Now the other things that come with it are first a geometric basket. And this is a really nice size basket. It will hold all of the yarn that you get in the kit. It's a geometric, really uh, fancy basket. And it's um, mostly triangles. And it's in a mint green color. You can also get in the kit a Llama Rama pencil case. This is just adorable. And it has the mint green color and three llamas on each side. They're facing all different directions. I love that. And the zipper pull is a pom-pom. And it's a really tight, uh, tightly made pom-pom. It's really cool. So you can keep your pencils in there. Or you can keep your um, little small notions. Pens and, or pencils, um, scissors, stitch markers, you name it. Okay, then we have a much bigger bag. This is called the Llama Rama Large Cosmetic Bag. Now, I use this for um, when I make socks because it holds everything I need in there. It's really an awesome bag. It's just really big enough to hold your yarn and your stitch markers and your socks and your whole project all at once. It's a really cute bag. It also has a nice little pom-pom on it. And there's a lot of room in there. So, you could actually get this whole kit and divide it up into lots of different gifts for people. Okay, and then next you get five full skeins of Billow yarn. So, Billow yarn is really quite beautiful. Um, it's a bulky yarn and it's also got a thick and thin texture. So if you don't like thick and thin textures you shouldn't use this yarn but actually it's 100% Pima cotton. Um, the colors that you get are Whisper, Clarity, Sage, White, and Cadet. So here's the five colors and they all manage to fit in this basket. Very nice. This billow yarn, by the way, besides being in the bulky weight, there are 120 yards in the hank, or 100 grams. And you can, um, I will show you later how to uh, roll this into a ball from the hank that it comes in, because you can't use it just like this. You have to put it on a umbrella swift and um, wind it into a ball or have someone hold it for you while you wind it. So anyway, I thought you might really like to see this llama collection because you can get it all all at once at Knit Picks. One more thing I'd like to tell you about this yarn is it's kind of a, a rustic texture and but it's sort of modern all at once. It's really super soft. It works up quickly and some people like it because it's easy to work with and fast for baby blankets and afghans. So it's got the thick and thin like I told you and um, one person in the reviews that I read um, said it feels dreamy next to your skin. There are other llama accessories at Knit Picks and you just be sure to check them all out. Um, the folks at Knit Picks are very helpful and friendly too. And now in addition to the llama kit, I bought some books. 
um, two of which have the afghan pattern in to use the billow yarn. I like to use um, patterns that are specifically for the yarn I get because then I know it's going to work out probably a lot better. The first one is called Tucked In. It's got uh, chic cozy blankets and this one is the actual, it shows the one that uses the billow yarn. There's squares and stripes that can use it below. You can make the forest path. And there's just like a nice variety. This um, especially Starry Splendor blanket here, um, it's really good for the billow yarn and it gives it kind of a country look. Just a nice comfortable um, blanket. So this book has patterns in that use billow Wool of the Andes, Wool of the Andes Tweed, and Wool of the Andes Superwash. Now, you can buy this book, hard or like soft to cover, they'll send that to you. Or you can also get the ebook. Now, the ebook is a lot cheaper, but you've got to print it yourself. So, I've got both actually, because I like to write in my books sometimes, like what I did. So, this is how you could actually download the ebook. You can actually just use the ebook on your phone or on your computer too without spending the money to print it out. There were two other books I was interested in while I was at Nipix. This one's called Milestones and Memories. And it's got the cutest, homiest patterns in it. Cats and hearts and sewing machines. And you knit with a graph so you can put any of these pictures onto your pillow or into your afghan. This is a really cute baby pillow. So it's just another one of the items that you can get at Knit Picks. And the third one I got, which is going to be pretty challenging for me, but I wanted to get it while I saw it, is um, the Celtic or Celtic Journey by Knit Picks. And they have, all their sweaters have these beautiful cables in. I've never made those, so I'm looking for a challenge, and maybe one day I'll be able to show you something that I made. <laughs> but they have hats and sweaters in here, and the hat is probably a good thing to start with for cables because you will, you know, be able to get it done quicker than a whole sweater. But once you get the hat figured out, um, you can go into one of these hooded sweaters or jackets or pullovers. So that's just a very nice uh, book from Knit Picks also. They have lots of things there and I'm sure you'll find something that you like. They have lots of tutorials too for learning how to knit. And I guess that's all I want to show you today. I hope you liked all these little llamas and I hope you get a chance to check Knit Picks out. There's a link down below and please like and subscribe. Thank you. Have a wonderful day.